Hey everybody, Dr. Pancake Face here, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to enable the open beta skills that are currently available in Payday 2. Now, now we don't actually want Payday 2 open to be able to do this, so, uh, but we do need Steam open, so we're going to open up Steam, and we're going to go under the library, go into the games, and we want to find Payday 2, I've got it right here. Um, now you won't normally see this open beta next to it, uh, if you don't have the open beta enabled, which you shouldn't. Um, but what you do, you right click on it, come down here to properties, we're going to click on that and we're going to go over here to betas. Um, click on beta and um, you're going to click this drop down here and normally you will have none selected. Um, just click on open beta right here and then click close and it will download an update down here and then you... Um, you started the game. It's actually pretty simple. Now, that <laughs> that part's actually the easy part. Here's where it gets a little complicated. Because um, the developers of Payday, Overkill, they actually say, uh, participate in the open beta at your own risk. You might lose your save file, so please back it up before you start. Um, so I'm actually going to walk you through a simple way, one of the ways you can back up your save file. Um, now I'm actually going to have linked in the description below, I'm going to have both um, a link to the page that Overkill put up on how to enable the open beta, and I'm also going to have a link to the page on several different ways to back up your game save for Payday 2. Uh, but I'm just going to go on ahead and show you how I did mine. I basically went right to it, and you can see right here, here is my backup for Payday 2. Put it right there, right next to it. <laughs> That's my backup for Payday 2. That's that's my whole game save before I enabled open beta. So if something, if something happened, fucked up the game save, and I lost everything right there, all I have to do is copy that file right into the file where it saves the game save for Payday 2, and then just start the game up. Boom. Problem solved. So what we want to do is um, you want to open up Explore, and you want to normally you would go under... Um, C drive and then go under Steam, but I have actually moved all of my Steam files to an additional uh, hard drive right here. Um, but yeah, basically you would go under your C drive, find Steam, open up Steam, and then go under Steam again. Um, then uh, we want to come down here to user data, and then it should be the first one. Might not always be the first one, but it should be the first one. Um, and then we want to find this one right here, 218620. This is the file that we're looking for. Open this up, go into remote, and then um, for some reason I have two saves here. Not entirely sure why. Uh, <laughs> but essentially, this is the save that you want to uh, copy. Should be save 098. Um, but just copy that game save. I copied it right to my desktop so that I wouldn't lose it. Because, I mean, if it's just a file sitting on my desktop for no reason, obviously I'm not going to lose this thing because I'm going to go, oh, hey, there it is right there. <laughs> but yeah, if something were to happen um, and my game save got fucked up, all I would have to do is copy this file right back into here. And boom, problem solved. So, yeah, just click, drag and drop onto the desktop. I'm not going to do that because it will overwrite this one. Um, but yeah, that is how you back up the save. There are several other ways you can do it. You can do a cloud backup. Uh, you can do a Windows backup. You can go under the, uh, the um, command prompt and do a backup that way. But, uh, you know, those are all kind of complicated backups and they kind of have their pros and cons. I mean, I just, I just find this so much simpler. Just a boom right there. Save it on the desktop. And I've got the file. No problem. <laughs> But yeah, that, that is how you enable the open beta skills, and that is how you back up your save, which you are going to want to do. Definitely, definitely back up your, your game save. I mean, you should be doing it constantly, um, but definitely back up your game save before you go into the open beta, because if you, if you lose your game save just screwing around with the open beta skills, oh my god, I can only imagine how much that would upset you. <laughs> I'm... I'm at prestige number 13. Um, hell, I'm halfway to top prestige, but or infamy, sorry. 
prestige. Sitting Call of Duty, what am I talking about? <laughs> I'm, I'm at Infamy 13, and holy shit, I would be pissed if I lost all of my game saves. Wow. That would infuriate me. So, yeah, I went on ahead and uh, backed up my game save. Um, but, yeah, that is how you do all that stuff. Um, if you need to see, like, you know, written out version of that, take a look down at the, uh, the description below. I'll have a link to both of those pages. A, I'll have a link to Overkill's page on how to enable the beta skills. And I'll have a link to um, a guide set up by a guy named Rag. Thanks, Rag. Awesome. Um, I'll have a guide set up, or I'll have a link to a guide set up by Rag. There we go. <laughs> and it has several different ways to back up your saves. Um, so if you need to, go and check those out. Uh, but yeah, that pretty much does it for this video. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, go on ahead and hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. And I'll catch you guys later. Oh! Oh! <laughs> Two of them in a row! <laughs>